How's it going guys? Today we'll be looking at the Vmoda Boom Pro microphone which is a detachable, flexible, omnidirectional microphone accessory that you can add to your Sony WH-1000XM series headphones or any headphones that has a 3.5mm audio jack. This is not an official accessory from Sony but this could be a must-have accessory to any headphones that either don't come with a microphone or if you're looking into getting a better sound quality microphone. Whichever the case, hear me out. Hi, my name is Ken and welcome back to the channel where we talk about filmmaking, photography, iPad Pro related content and tech. If any of this piques your interest, consider subscribing to the channel as you may learn a thing or two from these videos. I got to be honest with you guys that this is a OEM product, which is not the original Vmoda Boom Pro microphone. With that in mind, here are some of the topics that we'll be discussing today. Sit back, relax and enjoy the video. Let's dive right in. So the WH-1000XM3 and XM4 are a Bluetooth headphone that has a built-in microphone. I did a video on the differences between the Sony WH-1000XM4s versus the XM3s a while back. A little drop down cut right here if you haven't checked it out. However, the catch about using auxiliary amplitude jacks on the Sony WH-1000 series headphones is that it only provides audio output and you cannot utilize the built-in microphone. What a bummer, right? This applies to all Sony WH series headphones from XM1s to the XM4s. Here is where the Vmoda Boom Pro microphone comes in handy for providing a decent microphone setting when using your headphones plugged in. Just putting out here again, I have gotten an OEM version of the original product, so I don't have a box. But let's unpack what's in the package. I'll leave a link in the description box below for the actual Vmoda Boom Pro microphone unboxing if you're keen to see what comes in the original package. In the package, it comes with only two types of cable, a wire cable connector for audio input and microphone input on one end, and the other end is the female 3.5mm headphone jack. The next is the Boom Pro microphone itself, more details about it in a second. Here is a tiny box which has clipped to attach on your clothes, and on the sides, it comes with a mic mute button switch, as well as a volume knob control. And that's about it! Since this is an OEM product, I won't go too deep into details for this microphone, as the original quality of the product may differ from this. But here is the omnidirectional microphone with a flexible cord. It stays in position after you bend it and the overall build quality of it feels pretty good. The weight of the microphone is about 30 grams and the length of the provided cables is about 190 centimeters. The good thing about the cables is that it comes braided for a tangle-free experience. As mentioned earlier, it comes with a Y adapter to separate both microphone and audio input which is super useful on a desktop setup. If you don't require it, the Vmoda Boom Pro microphone has a right angle 3.5mm jack that supports left and right audio input and a microphone input. This little attachment right here has a switch at the sides which has the mute function and on the other side is a volume control knob. This little clamp right here allows users to attach this tiny box on part of their clothes to avoid accidental pulls disconnecting your microphone from your headset. Here are the specs provided by Vmoda about the microphone if you're into spec sheets. I'll also leave a link in the description box below for your reference. Let's move on with a quick sound test of this microphone. I'll be reading a text from a random book entitled Unlimited Power by Anthony Robbins. Comparing the sound quality coming from my video micro mini, which I use to film on all of my videos, versus this Vmoda Boom Pro microphone, and also the Sony WH-1000XM3's built-in microphone. Let's have a read. Chapter 6. Mastering your mind. How to run your brain. Don't find fault. Find a remedy. Henry Ford. This chapter is about finding remedies. We've talked so far about what you should change if you wish to change your life. What kind of states empower you? And what kind of states leave you limp? In this section, you're going to learn how to change your states so you can produce whatever you want, when you want it. People don't usually lack resources. They lack control over their resources. This chapter will teach you how to be in control, how to get more juice out of life, how to change your states, your actions, and thus the results you produce in your body, all in a matter of moments. And we're back. Pretty good sound quality if you ask me. I mean, coming from a third-party OVM product, for a microphone. Let me know in the comment sections which is better, the Vmoda microphone or the WH-1000XM3s. I think we have a clear winner here that the Vmoda microphone is way better. I think this is a really really good buy, even though it's an OEM product, but I feel the Vmoda original product would be better. I don't know. If you're wondering about the slightly slimmer profile of the 3.5mm audio jack on the Sony WH-1000XM3s or XM4s, no worries about it. The Vmoda Boom Pro microphone also has a slim 3.5mm audio jack that fits in perfectly. And notice the standard 3.5mm audio jack is normally bigger than the housing on the WH-1000XM3s or XM4s. But this one fits pretty well. 
It stays on in the jack pretty snuggish and it definitely stays in place when plugged in. So given that you can actually utilize your WH-1000XM3s on a desktop setup with a microphone and not just relying on Bluetooth connection, I would consider you picking this up as part of your gaming setup if you're interested. For a price of 30 ringgit, about 10 US dollars, this particular OEM product fits the budget. Instead of actually forking out another 200 ringgit for a decent gaming headphones like the Logitech G series headphones or the HyperX Cloud series. Why not utilize this headphone accessory just for microphone input? You can still use the 3.5mm audio jack with an industrial level audio sound quality and superior comfort coming from the Sony wh one of xm series headphones. It's a no-brainer for me to get it. Also take note that if your headphone jack is non-detachable, then you will not be able to use this accessory. That is all I have for you guys in this video. Not a true v Boda Boom Pro microphone review, but just a glimpse of the existence of such a product to complement your WH-1000XM3 or XM4 series headphones if you want to utilize your headphones 3.5mm audio jack with microphone input. If you have any other questions, feel free to leave me a comment down below. I'll be sure to get back to you guys as soon as possible. Thank you guys so much for watching. Like the video if you actually enjoyed it and subscribe if you haven't already. As always, I'll see you guys very very soon. Stay safe, peace out and bye bye.